We are the Falco family. Brian, Serena, Cameron, Kendall, and Savannah. We're a family of five driven by purpose and fueled by love. We decided to trade in the traditional school life for a life where every day is an adventure of faith and love. From a small photography business grew a love of memory keeping and filmmaking that turned into a full blown dream of becoming a family of filmmakers exploring the truth about education. So we're learning to document our adventures in homeschool business and life and tell stories of how we live and what we learn. Good morning. Why is my camera dying already? My camera's basically like my phone, always at 2%. <laughs> Good morning, friends. All right, let me get a new battery. All right, there we go, new battery and all. So I found this quote that I love so very much and has everything to do with what we are doing in life right now. So I'm gonna use these little letters to punch out a new quote for this cute board that Brian's mom gave us. Used it for Easter time and now I'm gonna put something new on it. <laughs> Setting up our tripod for the day, friends. We've been talking about it forever and now we're trying to be about it. So <laughs> I'm, I'm getting my gear set up. I try to um, take out um, some of my gear every day. Try to set it up in different places for the documentary. Filmed a video to go in our friends club space to kind of share a bit about how we are approaching the films, if they are documentary, TV shows, short films. We kind of have a starting plan and we're kind of giving room to it all. But right now what I try to do is take my gear and set it up every day. And then I have a little goal of the type of footage that I want to try and gather for that day. And then of course I have my writing time. So fun fact, I actually kind of hate tripods. <laughs> I'm used to having my camera and just being on the go with the kids, but now I'm trying to be a bit more intentional to sit my camera in certain spots and um, try to be a little bit more careful about the footage that we're gathering. So I have my camera going here because if I don't use it, I'll never get to know it like the back of my hand. And that is kind of the goal. I need to uh, finalize a couple of posts for our friends club. This is something I am learning to do to just kind of set my stuff up. And when I have a moment, I can pop in and edit because editing takes up a lot of time, especially when you're doing several projects at once so trying to share these vlogs with you guys and then of course I have other things I'm filming for our friends club but my biggest thing biggest thing that I want to give attention to writing for the films gathering footage for the films editing for the films I have to put in that work because I'll never get to where I envision us being as this family of filmmakers if I don't actually make the films friends. I think I have a schedule for this week to film a video for my friends club um, because that's kind of like my accountability group. I want to share all about how I am laying out the process. The more I say it, the more terrified I feel because I'm like, Serena. <laughs> He's starting all the way from the bottom, but that's okay because that's what I want. I want um, to be able to tell the stories that we have in our hearts. So that's gonna take time and it's gonna be a lot of growing and learning and failing and all of that stuff. I'm game for it. I did write a little bit of a list to keep me on track today um, between homeschool and filming and writing and stuff like that. So. Um, I am at the very first part of Monday. I do want to get this edit done by the end of the day. I just want to sit down and talk a couple seconds about how I've been feeling lately, which has everything to do with this quote I'm about to put on this board. I also have a bunch of fun flashback type of clips that I want to include in this vlog that I'm editing, so I'm going to do that today too. I have a super fun project that I kind of just threw together, which is really not a project, I don't know, um, but I'll tell you all about that. So we're gonna be heading to the bookstore to get what we need in order to get that project started. I need to um, make a little bit of an outline because I'm gonna be going live tomorrow in our Facebook group for the Friends Club. And I'm gonna be talking monthly goals, how I'm laying them out, and uh, sharing all those types of things. So I wanna have a little bit of an outline so I don't end up being super rambly. Because you know, we're trying to protect our time, friends. <laughs> 
yeah so over here just trying to wake up and be awesome and it looks like you guys are gonna be following along ma'am hello <laughs> Oh, mommy, okay, so, yes. guess what yeah. I did last night? What did you do, mama? I I started the bland system since I didn't have Jenga doll with my room last night. And you like it? It was bye! <laughs> <laughs> Sisters Jandice and Kale. Okay. And the, the mom, the parents sent them a letter. Okay. That the Aunt Charlotte was coming over. So the first one is where they got kidnapped by pirates. Just figured out that it's not Aunt Salad. So it's a mystery? Yes! <laughs> I started the second one. Okay. And you like it so far? <laughs> Let's handle this math. Okay, so mm -hmm. multiply the pair of numbers below in your head. So it's 19 mm -hmm. times 10,000. So you got it correct, but you're having trouble with the placement of the, um, of the, what is that? Zero. No. Comma. Yes. Oh. So let's go ahead and put in the answer you got. One, two, three, and then this would be another if there was another number. 19 times 10,000 equals 190,000. Okay, let's let's go ahead and select. Let's enter our answer, friend. You did it. You did it! <laughs> okay, so Vanna Girl started a new book. She's working her way through math. I'm gonna get this quote on here. Finally, we'll get to the rest of our day. I'm reading The Unintentional Adventures of the Bland Sisters, The Uncanny Express. Okay. But this is the first one. All right, this is that the first one. one. Oh, so we, if we go to the bookstore today, do you wanna start with the first one? Yeah. Okay. There's my boo with the glasses. So we've got our book stacks over here because we didn't finish taking book pictures yet. Hey baby cakes. It's so hard to record them these days because they move so fast. You know, babies, you thought babies moved fast, but you could kind of sort of get them to stay in one place and smile. But these kids, they have their own agenda. They have their own goals, their own plans. So it's a whole challenge, friends. Also, I don't know if you've ever noticed, but I still haven't put a picture in that picture frame. <laughs> We have this one here, but I have yet to get something in that one. Working on it, friends. Homes are a work in progress, aren't they? Waiting for them so we can go on our walk and still haven't finished this, y'all. But I'm almost there. All right, we did it, friends. You're my home and my adventure all at once. Please try and tell me that's not the cutest. <laughs> Friends, it's Serena from the Falco family and today I just wanted to do a little bit of a walkthrough type of video, short and sweet, to talk to you about a reading vlog. The kids are eating lunch now. I just finished filming um, a little video to add well, actually for our friends club um, that I'm going to be able to add to the shop. I want to add these little video clips that just kind of walks through how we use our printables so I can attach them to the printables that are in on our shop. So I just finished doing that. Now I'm going to grab some lunch before I get to edits. You're doing it. Go ahead. <laughs> keep going. Yeah. You almost got it. You did it. <laughs> now I need a little band. I did this one. See? We live and we learn. So we are going to be giving a lot of our merch away because we have closed our store in order to focus in on our friends club. <laughs> Savannah, yeah. leave it alone. We're gonna Can we even sell them? Yes. And we're going to give them away in our friends club. All right, so it's editing time. I got my seltzer. I've been using this soda stream for a minute and I love it. Okay, y'all know how much I drink seltzer. I love not having so many plastic bottles all around the house. All right, it's editing time. I love this part of my day. Sometimes it's really challenging. It's really frustrating because we are creatives and we are on this journey to make these films, y'all. So along the way, I get to share vlogs and 
our memories with you guys through these videos and I love that, but it is a lot of work. But we've been doing a few things lately um, and it keeps me accountable to making sure that I keep a good account of our memories because they matter. So I normally try to sit down and catch up on some of the things that we've been doing just to make sure that those memories don't slip away. I've got some clips from a recent trip to Wonder Space in Philadelphia, Williamsburg. We had a little staycation type of situation. A few memories from Easter. So I'm going to get those edited so I can drop them into this video and it just really makes me think about that quote. It makes me think of it because I really feel like it defines who we are and where we are. Um, and the fact that these kids, this husband of mine, and this family that we've created on the interwebs, and of course our friends and family in real life, um, they are our home and our adventure all at once. So I'm going to just sit down and take some time, as always, to pull these memories together because we basically are the memories we keep. Happy Resurrection Day! <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> That's a good one! So I've got Chef Kendall cooking it up this morning. One thing that's always been really important to me about our channel and our videos is that whatever we do, whatever dream related, business related, um, influencer type of things that we kind of set our hands to like I want to make sure that all of my videos are something that I can go back and watch and I know that like this was our memories these are our family memories I love that these videos tell little stories of the memories that we keep of our family and our friends and things like that and I hope to do more of that but yeah they're my home and my adventure all at once <laughs> this is why you don't you don't put me in charge of arts and crafts. Hope you enjoyed this video. Remember, life is so very full of lessons, and our goal is to live and to learn. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe.